Steve and Jessica, you guys are big fans of Zach Downtown. Can you please tell me three essentials for a Zach Downtown concert? Ooh, three essentials. Mad bitches, <laughs> mad liquor, and mad bitches. Hello, Jacques Morel here with Zach Downtown for DJ Booth TV. Right now we are actually here downtown in New York City at Santos Party House. Can you tell us a little bit about what's going to go on here tonight? Hey man, uh, we got a show here tonight with Jared Edmond. Fucking, uh, it's going to be wild. We got MPC, drums, uh, full band. You know, it's always dope to do shit in the city, get the home fans to come out, you know, it's fun. So, you just came back from South by Southwest, nine grueling long days, and you said even though the people, <laughs> so the people are nicer, but they smell. What was your, um, what was your, what, what was it like down in Texas? You know, I think it was just, I haven't been out of the city for that long, in a long time, and, you know, it's a music festival. Everyone down there is just... They're there enjoying themselves, which is what we ended up doing, but it's just a whole different scene down there. Everyone is just there for the music, and it's awesome. Everyone's partying and just enjoying themselves. Name is Zach Downtown. What are your favorite spots to go downtown? I mean, everywhere, man. It's anywhere downtown. I always like to shout out my boy Johnny Lennon at Gold Bar. That's my favorite spot. We shot a music video there. So what are you working on in the future that uh, the, the users of DJ Blue should check out? Uh, we're putting out a lot of singles over, you know, remixes on tracks, and then we're working on a bunch of original production, hopefully gonna put out an album come end of spring, summer maybe, and then hopefully we're gonna be going on a tour in like May and June. On an when you're tour. done with school? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I'll skip school to go on tour. <laughs> Would you really? Yeah, yeah absolutely. Don't what do your parents do. think about that though? Uh, my mom's all for it. I think, I don't know. She, does she have like a very important uh, influence in with your yeah. new music creation? Absolutely. My mom actually used to, she's right over there, to be honest. But um, <laughs> my mom used to work for Cameo, which was a uh, like funk group in the 70s and 80s. And they were pretty popular. And, you know, she, we actually have a gold record in my house from when she worked with them. So that's, you know, that's inspiration for me. I look at that every day. Where do you see music going in the next year? Um, Especially your music on top of that. Uh, music is crazy, man. Everything is becoming infused. You hear like pop radio singles, they need to have like a hip hop verse on it, even if it's from like Flo Rida or somebody. Those pop, so there's that. And then there's hip hop artists that are starting to use electronic and dubstep sound. I just heard a Lupe Fiasco song over with Bass Nectar, and like, you know, that was like. I, I released a dubstep track, I think a year ago or six months ago, over a Flux Pavilion track, and that was one of my most popular tracks. And like, I think it's cool to infuse all that sound. I don't think there needs to be like any stereotypes on shit. Well, I want to thank you, Zach Downtown. Seriously, and I want to wish you a good show. Um, can you let them know where else they can find more information about you? Zachbooth.net, new music all the time, my music all the time, dope website, check it out. <laughs>